Well, it's almost time for Mardi Gras, but there's no reason to travel all the way down to New Orleans to celebrate. Principal scientist and flavor master, I love that title, Claude Davis is here. He says you can stay right here in Baltimore, make your own jambalaya with Zatarain, smoke sausage, and celebrate the festivities here. That's true, right? We can do that. Absolutely. It's, it's Mardi Gras season in yeah. New Orleans, and we want to bring a little bit of Mardi Gras to Baltimore. Okay, so tell us what you brought. You brought a lot here. Well, today <laughs> we're going to do jambalaya. It's pretty mm -hmm. synonymous with Mardi Gras. You have big crowds, big families, so yes. uh, we cook jambalaya, and what we have is a new sausage. So we have a Cajun sausage and andouille sausage. So what I have in the skillet here is we typically take our celery, onions, bell pepper, and for this carnival jambalaya, what we're going to do is add a little bit of red and green bells to give it a little flavor, you know, yes. festive for carnival. And you said we can have sort of like a jambalaya bar. What does that entail? You can have a jambalaya bar, and I'll toss the sausage in here yes. just so we yeah, can get keep that cooking. going. I don't want to stop you from feeding um, me. <laughs> but a jambalaya bar essentially is you cook the rice yes. like you would normally cook it, but you don't add any meat to it. Oh. So, and then what you do is you customize it so... If you have different guests also with different diets, yeah, because I'm plant-based, plant-based yeah. or vegan, whatever it may be, right? You can, you can build have, it. You can build it. So you have seafood, you have sausage, yes. you have different veggies that you can add in, and we have a little display for you with that. And as thank well. goodness with Zatarans because even if you're not using all of the ingredients, once you have. Zatarain's products in your jambalaya, it's going to taste good. You're going to get that flavor. That's right. We give you all the flavor you need. Yes. Absolutely. And so this sausage right now, you really like cooking with it. I really I do. Tell. I love it. <laughs> so the andouille is less uh, spicy for mm -hmm. those who don't want a little bit of spice. Then we have the Cajun that's just right. Yeah, I It's need just that. the right amount of spice. <laughs> so you would be a person with Cajun. Yeah, so right. Basically, when you're cooking this jambalaya, the same as you do normally, I've added the sausage. I have my veggies, got everything going here. Yes. A nice little uh, temperature going. Uh -huh. You hear a little bit of the sear. You would add the water. Yep. Keep it cooking there. Keep it cooking. And then what ingredients make up that, so that smoked sausage? This sausage is 100% pork. Okay. Um, there's no MSG, no artificial flavors, mm -hmm. colors, etc. Mm -hmm. But we also, for example, with Cajun, we have our nice Cajun season. That's typically like white pepper, red pepper, yeah. black pepper added to it. And, you know, we can't tell everybody exactly. Right, exactly. Right? I don't want you to give it all away, but we want to know just like a little bit of that secret, what makes it taste so good. And that's what it is. We take our seasoning and put that in there. And so where can we get all of your products? You can find this sausage at the uh, Sam's Club okay. here locally. Food Lion, and it's yes. coming to Kroger very soon. Oh, it is? Okay, great. And the jambalaya you should be able to find anywhere around here. Actually, Maryland is one of our top markets. I'm not surprised. <laughs> we know good food. We know good food. And you brought all, I mean, some of these things that you brought to, I'm going to, hold on, stay right here. Okay. I'm going to reach over here because I like this little platter. I know I'm okay. going off camera. Okay. Sorry, but it is that serious. You want to move the sausage? Over I'm just going to hold it okay. <laughs> because I love this little party platter. Mm -hmm. I think it's like, it's really unique. You did that with the little uh, pretzels. Yes. So this is uh, something one of my, my favorite people at work. She came up with this idea. It's cute. We saute the sausage. Yes. Then we take little pretzel sticks. And then this is our Zatarain's Creole mustard. So it's, it's perfect for dipping and, you know, right. any mustard that you prefer, but, you know, it goes, it pairs really well with our Zatarain screen. So we really can throw our little parties and yes, it can, can feel authentic. And when you have Mardi Gras, I mean, yeah. you'll have big crowds, a lot of uh, friends come over. So you yes. need a lot of different finger right. foods and things you can feed <laughs> We're them. definitely so going to have big crowds. Sausage so is a great out. one. Absolutely. Absolutely. Okay, so more recipes and getting more ideas. Where can we go? So you mentioned the bar. Yes. We have our bar where we've cooked the rice, and then you have things like mushrooms, yeah. tomatoes, chicken, shrimp, sausage, of course. Add all that in. Yep. Bell pepper, onions. Perfect. And, uh, all right. And so we just go to Zatarans.com. Zatarans.com. All right. Thank you so much, Claude. Appreciate you being here. And we'll be right back with Thank more you. Midday Maryland right after this.